Well, it feels like about a lifetime ago that I made fun of you, the viewers, for panicking about a loss, so I'd like to rectify that right now. Frame me up, get me, got me, love it. This is fine. This is fine. I am okay with the events that are currently unfolding with the Dallas Cowboys. Hi, been that type of month. David Hellman, Rico's, Ask the Boys. Uh, let's just hop right into it. I'm gonna do a big bag. Uh, why not? Like, let's just take a lot of questions because that way uh, we can try to take our minds off of what we've been watching for the last three weeks. Steven says, what has turned last year's stellar defense into a wet pool noodle? Hey, everybody, that's his words, not mine. I didn't say that. Um, but yeah, the Cowboys' defensive woes are probably the dominant storyline of this losing streak. They haven't been very good on any of the three levels of the defense, pass rush, D-line, linebacker, secondary. It's all been pretty bad. It's a big part of the reason why they've lost three games in a row. I honestly don't know. Um, it's, it's the same group of guys for the most part. There's been some injuries, I guess. Demarcus Lawrence, Byron Jones didn't have much of a training camp. Tyrone Crawford just went on IR. But by and large, like the playmakers that were there last year are the same guys. Um, I don't know how to make you feel better about this other than to say, hopefully as they keep playing, they'll round back into form. Because otherwise, I'm not sure how you wave a magic wand and fix all three layers of the defense. Sorry, Steven. That's about all I got. Uh, Dylan says, what's your liquor of choice to get through our games? You know I'm a sports writer, right? I, I work during the games, Dylan. Uh, so none. But I usually have a glass of whiskey uh, when I get home. Don't tell anybody. Alan with a hypothetical from the upside down. He says, let's say we have a crappy season. Dak looks above average, but we draft top 15. Would you tag Dak and draft a quarterback? That's a lot, and if Dak is playing well, why would they be that crappy? I don't know, I don't really buy this. Here's the thing, the Cowboys have lost three games in a row. Dak's not really the reason why, in my opinion. He's top five in explosive plays, he's top three in passing yards, he's accounted for 11 passing touchdowns and two rushing touchdowns. Like, the guy's pretty good. And for that matter, let's say they're picking 10 to 15, I, you're probably not getting a top-notch quarterback without trading up from there. Uh, just, just no. Just, I'm gonna say no. Um, quarterback is, is not this team's problem. I know you all think I'm a giant Dak homer. It's my quarterback. But no, Alan. Uh, no, I'm not doing that. Which, to Michael's point, Michael says, biggest weakness and how can the Cowboys address it with their first round pick? Well, stop me if you've heard this before. Uh, defensive tackle and safety both look like problem spots. Mm, so, I'd probably start there. You could sell me on a good offensive tackle, uh, just with the injury concerns and, and the increasing age of Tyron Smith, you could talk me into that, but uh, D-tackle safety, did I cover tackle? Yeah, I did. Um, a slot receiver doesn't sound like the worst idea in the world either. So th those three, uh, which are all things that we've talked about in the past. Uh, where do I want to go next? Steph says, what's it like reading your mentions after all these Cowboys losses? Caden, throw it to the gif of the guy in the costume running through the minefield. Yep, that's the one. That's it. That's what it's like. It's not that much fun, but I love you all. Trey says, I was just introduced to Boudin and dude, what have I been missing? Delicious uh, Louisiana snack. It's, it's basically rice stuffed in sausage. It's incredible. Good job, Trey. You know the way to my heart, you're welcome. Brian, uh, who's the better Joker, Heath Ledger or Joaquin Phoenix? Haven't seen Joker, don't care. Why do we need another edition of the Joker? Like how many of these movies are they gonna make? I don't care about that, I'm sure it's great. Shade says, how about the No Fun League hire some full-time professional refs? The Green Bay Detroit game was a dumpster fire. So was the Cowboys Jets game for that matter. And you're absolutely right. How does this industry make as many billion dollars as it makes? And the guys who settle these games are CPAs, lawyers, and garbage men during the week. I don't have the foggiest idea. That's pretty high on the list of things I would change if I could. 
Larry says, I have seen you with various sunglasses over the years. What is your favorite maker? Uh, like maybe the number one advice I could give anybody, why would you ever spend more than like $10 on a pair of sunglasses? I buy mine in bulk from Amazon, so when I lose them, I don't care. Um, the show's more fun when the Cowboys win, but they're not winning right now. Hopefully that changes. Appreciate all your feedback. This has been Ask the Boys, presented by Rico's, a quality, wholesome vendor of fine American food products. Thank you for watching. If you missed any part of this show or want to see more Dallas Cowboys content, check us out on the Cowboys Now app on any of your connected TV devices.